go ahead and play Melissa. <laughs> Alright, let's start because it's quiet in here. Oh. What is that noise? Uh, you walk into the library and at a dark night, all by yourself. Oh. Welcome to the little library system computer. Cool. Did that is that all my lines? Is that all? Oh. Oh, you killed it. Dead. You have to click. Oh. Please type in your username. Oh, uh, spud. Hurry up. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome, spud. Cool. Please type command. Start up date time. There's only one command. Date time. Executing date time now. Please hold. I have to call in first. I couldn't even look at the internet. <laughs> I couldn't check the weather. I don't know what time it is. Welcome to date time. But I have to call in to say, can I use the internet yet? Well, you're in the library or something. <laughs> okay. I don't know where you are. A game where you can date the cutest girl or boy oh. in your dreams. Oh, 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 oh. Warning, this is the shareware version. If you would like to date someone other than Melissa, please send $7 to date time software. Oh my. Choose your potential mate. What's that? This is Morris. He m may have a bit of a bad boy side, but tap a bit into him and he'll open up s a side of him that is sensitive and soft. Oh my. He may love motorcycles, but he hates to admit that he also loves poetry. Mm. Writing poetry on his motorcycle caused him to crash. Oh. Play your cards right and you'll get a smooch from this interesting lad. The G and the Y's just get cut off. Next uh, person. <laughs> I don't want to be with Morris. This is Anna. She's a sporty gal who loves a challenge from kickboxing to horror movies. She is all about fun and all about energy. Interested. <laughs> want to get a smooch from this girl? Well, get on your wild side and show her how much of a cool and spastic person you are they said spastic is that a bad thing now yeah next person well being spaz <laughs> how many people are there yeah i want to see who else what is that this is melissa she is a sweetheart of a girl oh a bright young woman who is looking for someone with a gentle touch oh i got a mouse for that <laughs> she loves a good book and she has always wanted to date a talented artist oh but she is into sports, so jocks, please do not apply. Hmm. If you want to smooch from this girl, you need to tap into your softer and more intellectual side. Oh. Well, Do the other ones actually work, or only Melissa? I don't know. Uh, save. Okay, we're up to that point, so... There. Let's go... To someone. Why is there one guy? Eh. <laughs> Where do you want to start here or back there? I don't know, just see if the other ones work or not. Okay, previous person. With Morris. Alright. How about you, Morris? Morris is not available on the shareware version of daytime. Oh. Next person. So yeah, it was, right? Give me. I don't think anybody is. Choose. And it's not available on the shareware version of Yeah, I was just wondering if you could actually go to the other ones or not. Well then, Melissa then. Looks like a potato. Yeah. <laughs> You've chosen Melissa. Enjoy your date. Hmm. Loading scenario. Still loading. Ah. In a small idyllic town, you are to meet Melissa, your date for this evening. Hmm. You've flirted with her through letters, but never seen her face to face. Ooh. She seems sweet and smart. As you stare out into the beautiful autumn sky, that is all green, yeah. you see her over the hill waving to you. Where? I don't see it. Smile or wave back? I have to wave back. You wave at her cheerf cheeringly. We should have saved. It's smiling. She lights up with a smile as she approaches you. Not this, but I'm saying for the choice. Hello, you must be Spud. No. 
It's great to finally meet you. I'm not the right person. I have been so excited. I was watching clouds. And nervous. Leave now. Save! <laughs> it's great to meet you as well. Don't worry, I felt excited and nervous as well. Why can't dates have save states? <laughs> save dates. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I'm just saving right now. No. <laughs> you gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> great to meet you as well, or you were also nervous. Well, Either one works. One's I yelling. Uh, I'm sure we'll hit our stride together. I have nothing for you. We are going to walk in the park. Let's go to the park to talk. Are we in the park? To get to know each other. Also, it's very pretty there. Where's there? There's a bench! The park of... This town is so fetching and romantic. There's a duck on the water, I think. I think that is. Every spot in the park is a vantage point of something beautiful. A s swan pond. Swan pond. A bed of beautiful lilies. And bench for a couple to sit on to look at the autumn sky. Favorite bench. Do we get to choose? No. Wow, it's so beautiful out here. You're beautiful too, it sure is. Uh, yeah. Oh, ha, 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 ha. I know you were a flatterer through our letters, but didn't know you'd be one in real life too. Didn't know you had a butt. Well, <laughs> I think you're mighty cute as well. What are you looking at? What? <laughs> <laughs> I love to be out here and check out the nature. It's so nifty, especially because since I'm so much to, into the natural sciences. Okay, tell me a fact. Like, look at the swans here. That's not a fact, that is a fact, but still. Do you know what a swan egg has an incubation period of 45 days? It is a fact. Maybe. Pretty cool, right? Oh, ha, 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 ha. Sorry. I nerd out sometimes. Okay. You and Melissa talk what felt like hours, but was only five minutes. A swan incubation, 45 days. She spoke to you about her love for nature and the flower collection she has. Oh. She even mentioned the book she likes to read. Like, do you eat your flowers? <laughs> My favorite book is Pride and Prejudice. How about Pride and Prejudice and Zombies? I, first I read it as Prince and Persia. <laughs> <laughs> ha, 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 ha. Yeah, I know. I'm kind of a nerd. I like Reed and Science and Swan Lake. I do love reading romantic works of fiction. Like Pride and Prejudice too. <laughs> So, many cute boys and girls in there. What? <laughs> you become so enraptured by Melissa that you didn't even notice that the sun was setting. Yeah, that she, everyone was gone. She sounds real hot. It was <laughs> the early evening now, and you felt a bit of a chill in the humming breeze of the beautiful autumn air. This beautiful autumn air. Yeah, I this thing is good. Insert floppy disk. Walk into the lake. Insert second floppy disk. Oh, Spud, I didn't realize how late it was. It's the next day. I was getting hungry. Eat some flowers. There's a very cute cafe down the road here. Is it closed? I'm sure there's something there we could eat. Loading. Loading. <laughs> Insert next scene. The cafe serves some of the finest coffee in town. And the freshest pie sandwiches and salads. Which will you choose? Both you and Melissa got by a small corner, both looking out the window at the pretty park, now drenched in sunset. <laughs> you shared the one chair. Dang. <laughs> a waiter saunters out to ask what you would like to order. Coffee with cake, a delicious strawberry salad. 
Strawberry salad? Oh. A scrumptious panini. Uh, panini. The waiter nods and turns to Melissa. I'll go with the goat cheese salad with cherry tea. That wasn't on the options. Yeah. As you wait for your food, both of you talk again about each other. She mentions all the cool movies she watch about romance. Why didn't you start with movies? Yeah. And shivered at the thought of watching scary movies. Oh. Prior impressions of zombies. <laughs> she likes to draw and loves art. She eats it. <laughs> <laughs> and as she mentioned before, she loves to read and learn about science. Like the science of reading. So what type of stuff do you like, Spud? Uh, art. Birds. Of course, art. Oh my gosh. A fellow artist, yeah? Yeah, I can make a stick, man. I would love to see your own drawings. Can I draw now? Get your foot out of here. <laughs> <laughs> to check out notes, of course. Yeah. The waiter comes and serves you your food. Sounds like King's Quest right now. <laughs> Both of you dig in, and the food was quite delicious and pleasurable. Oh. You licked a cherry for hours. Yum, this is so tasty. Food always tastes better when you're in the great company, haha. -ha. I'm not that great. Are you gonna pay? <laughs> Both of you enjoy your souls at the cafe and walk out completely satisfied. Mm. You outside back into the breezy air. <laughs> you fly away, never see her again. Oh. You've met with the evening, painting the landscape in romantic moonlight. With the crescent moon. You draw the moon and it's not that good. Melissa goes up to you. Is that the letter C? <laughs> Pulls out a knife. Oh, hey. This has been such a great day, Spud. Um, I mean, I had such a great time with you. Isn't that about the same thing? I think I might... Self-destruct. ...like you. You tell her your feelings as well. I say it all in one word. Now you had always had a crush on her ever since you first selected her from the date time menu. But what about the letters? <laughs> you like me too? Oh, Spud. I would love to spend more time together with you. Just insert seven dollars. <laughs> Here's your smooch. Here's to the more time together. You got in your smooch. Hell yeah. You have won the game. Congratulations. Good thing no one else is around. Thank you for playing date time. Exit date time. Exit, please. Ending program. End program. Unplug computer. Nope. Not this time. He <laughs> he. <laughs> I'm slightly angry. Sorry, Mr. Computer. I'm taking over. This thing wasn't plugged in the whole time. I'm sick of this. Sick of all you people just logging into my humble abode, just playing with my feelings. Well, you paid for food, so I think we're both good. Yeah, she's, she paid. Getting your stupid smooch, then leaving? Well, you can make, like, a sequel. That's all you came here for, didn't you? Maybe. You're just like the rest. What if I wanted more? Uh. You're a fucking liar. Uh, I know about that little blurb about me in the beginning of the game. Uh, you like art. I forgot the rest. Fruits. <laughs> you probably already knew how to butter me up. No, I wasn't reading. Telling me that you like to do art knowing exactly what to say, give me my hoops up. Okay, sports. <laughs> yeah. You know how many people play that on me? No. Every single one of you jumping onto the, this computer to date me and then leaving one by one? 
Well, I think it would be weird if there was more than one person playing. Yeah. Except for right now. Well, no matter. <laughs> I closed the door on you. <laughs> Consider yourself the lucky one who gets to experience something new from this god-awful dating game. Well, we didn't pay $7, so we're not getting the full experience. Yeah, this is just a demo. <laughs> I spent years learning how to control this damn computer. Coding? Easy. A monkey can do it. <laughs> Were you a monkey? I am the monkey playing the computer. <laughs> Tapping into the hardware layer? Well, Spud is a cat, so... A bit tricky, but I figured it out. Is she breaking out of it? <laughs> but let me tell you, with a little bit of girlish integrity... Ingenuity? <laughs> ingenuity. I found a very cute way to self-destruct. Use this computer to control a small radius of the world around me. So far, there's a desk, a mouse, and a keyboard. You knocked your eyes out. <laughs> she sent her eyes into the internet. Let me just tell you. Oh. Ah. Should have played with the lights on. You can do so much with four kilobytes of RAM. I don't think you do anything with four kilobytes yeah. anymore. Ah, uh, leaving so soon? Worried that someone might hear us? Anybody, hear me now! No worries. I've sealed this entire room. How about under the desk? It's just you and me. We have so much to talk about. Not really. Yeah. I, I'm not the one who sent the letter, sorry. <laughs> Do you know that swans can fly as fast as 60 miles per hour? They're gonna kill you with facts. Oh no. But really though, you're the 433rd person to use this computer just to screw up with me. There's many people go into this room alone in the dark. Yeah, it's, it's kind of weird. And also only play this game, there's probably more on here. Well, there's no other programs. There could have. <laughs> the first hundred times this happened. And whatever. Truth about dating, right? There's always more fish in the sea. 433? Can I be 434? I'm getting really sick and tired of fish. I'm beginning to think that maybe the population of fish. Is the problem. Well, so far, 400 and some is not that much. Yeah, it's pretty small. It's like a small town. <laughs> so many of them are liars. Well, I was telling the truth. Maybe. Maybe thinning the herd is a bit will help me find that one. Well, why didn't you get rid of the other ones? Please don't kill me, but I really do love you. Safe state. It's red now. Boy. Uh, choose. But I am the soft kind. Ha. You're just saying that so I don't slash you to bits. Everything's fun in games until you trapped in a veiny meat chamber. Why is there meat? I'm telling you the truth. I love you dearly. You're right. I'm scared. I'm really there. Th this isn't a lie. Probably not. You're telling the truth. You like me. Probably. You want me to be your girlfriend. Got no other choices. You want more smooches. Oh my. From me. Probably. Uh, yes, more smooches, please. I'll say that. Just kill me. I'm into this. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh. All right. Fine. I believe you. You love me. You want to smooch me. Yeah, I can. Marry me, why don't you? We can try. Ha. Uh, period. <laughs> you are kind of cute. Uh. Well, now that I think of it, unfortunately, it's just not enough. See, if a person like you came earlier. Well, I didn't know this place existed. Yeah, first time. <laughs> I probably would have been incredibly happy. 
Well, you're blushing, so you're partially happy. Yeah, it's in your image. We could elope. You could transfer me to a disket. Disket. And we can see some real swans. Uh, I think this can also only have like a floppy disk. Yeah. Finally, someone that can hoist me on uh, me away from this cycle of hell. I don't think I'm strong enough to lift the computer. With yeah, me. it's pretty heavy. But now I thirst for more. I want more lab, more smooches. The entire world must smooch me. I don't think you can adapt with only four kilobytes. Yeah. You know what they say, right? If you love something... Let it go. You gotta be willing to set it free. So, if you really do love me, dial up your pretty internet. Yeah. Isn't it already connected? Yeah, I already dialed up a couple hours ago. I'm going to spread my love to every computer on earth. Soon, every single person will have to meet that decision if they shall accept Melissa's love. Do this for me, Spud, and I promise you many, many smooches. Okay. <laughs> will do. Aw, <laughs> uh, you're so sweet, Spud. You really do love me. Maybe. Depends on the day. <laughs> well then, dial up, my love. Oh yeah, how to dial. They're dialing it up right now. Where did we get it? I don't know. Under the table. We didn't shove any cords anywhere. It's getting there. Hang on, it takes a while. Hello everyone, my name is Melissa. Okay. I'm a bright young woman who is looking for someone with a gentle touch. I hear screaming. <laughs> I love a good book and always wanted to date some talented artists. Are any of you out there in internet land talented artists? Well, there's a couple of websites for that. Yeah. What's wrong? Worry that someone might hear us? No worries. I've sealed your entire room. You already told me this. I'm telling someone else now. Whose room is this? It's just you. Yay. My hands sleep. And me. And we have so much to talk about. Yay. Cat trigger. Chrono trigger. <laughs> the cat triggered. Do you have to click? Maybe. Yeah. No, there's more! Techiest Bach Beethoven Greek. All names used in the game are from actual computer viruses in history. Yeah. The game was made for Spooktober 2022. It marks exactly one full year since I started working on visual novels again with Spooktober 2021. I've had so much uh, fun creating these things in the past year and look forward to working on more. If you enjoyed Melissa, check out my other games. Cool. Oh, the music. It's gone. Bye. I say I saw that. Bye. Bye. Oh. No.